All right, May 2nd, tomorrow, big day of giving, when we should all pitch in and help our favorite nonprofit organizations making a difference in our community. That's right, Fox 40's Monica Dianda is covering local news that matters, and Loom is at Quinona Family Services as they ask for your help on this big day of giving tomorrow. Monica, good morning. Well, good morning. So we are at Quinonia right now. Uh, Family Services, they offer a lot of support to the foster youth here in our region. I want to bring in Tiffany. Right now we are standing, good morning, by the way. Hi, we are standing at the Crisis Resolution Center. Tell me a little bit about the work that you guys do here in our community to help uh, thousands of kids. Oh. Yes, definitely. So Quinonia has been in Placer County for more than 40 years. We started in 1982. Um, since then, we've grown to uh, over 20 locations throughout the state of California and Nevada. Uh, our primary focus is um, the foster youth, um, but we're also, like you said, we're here in the Crisis Resolution Center. This is for members of the Placer County community. Anyone can self-refer, um, and it's really uh, a, a space where we can help uh, connect families to services in the community. We provide our own ancillary services, counseling, um, and in extreme cases, we have beds for up to six youth that can come stay here at any given time for up to 30 days, so a family can kind of cool off. Now this place feels really cozy, feels really, uh, it does make people feel yeah. like this is a home, right? And yeah. that's what you guys want. Tell me about the need here. Um, how many children really are in need of a, a fostering? Oh gosh, fostering, there's a huge need for families to take care of youth, especially older youth and sibling sets. It's just devastating to see how many kids are separated in foster care when they're removed. Uh, one child placed here, one child placed there. It's just really um, something we want to avoid. So we're really hoping that, uh, that, that this episode might help uh, bring awareness to the need for foster families in the Sacramento area. And then lastly, big idea of giving May 2nd, what is the uh, plea here to the community from you all? Yes, well, we understand that not everybody could be a foster parent, so if there's any way that you can help support our programs, tomorrow is the last day of Big Day of Giving. Um, if you're a company, it's not too late to get in on a giving match. Um, if you're able to do that to support us, that would be amazing. Otherwise, every bit helps. Uh, right now, we're facing a potential um, budget cut for our residential programs um, of up to 20% uh, that's been proposed. So we're really trying to find ways to, to supplement, uh, actually supplant that funding so if it, there's any way you can help, go to www.kfh.org slash bdog. That's B-D-O-G for Big Day of Giving. It would be awesome. Perfect. Thank Tiffany, thank, thank you. you so much. Again, this is the Quinonia Family Services. You can really make a difference here. Uh, last year alone, they helped nearly 2,000 youth in our community. So if you can make a difference, go ahead and donate to them. Reporting in Loomis, covering local news that matters, Monica Deanda.